Hello, and welcome back to Spirit Fur. Well, we're doing something last time. Uh, I quite remember. Yeah, I came here for the checks. Wait, no, that's wrong. Why am I here? Amber Lane, Evador. Oh. That really pulls a race? No? Okay. Well, I guess we can go. So then. I will. be watered in a second. Oh, we need to feed our chicken. You've been busy. Let's give him some flowers. Eat free. I know I said that I don't want to say goodbye to kid yet. That's why we will say goodbye to Mickey first. You shouldn't be asleep yet. Okay. How are you? Good time. <laughs> sure. No, I can. Mm, you're good. Whoa, thanks. This is so good. There was nothing about the thunderstorm. I remember. Oh, I really. I don't know what's your favorite fish. It's. Huh? It's I'm going to sleep. Everything became so dark all of a sudden. Yep. Good stuff. Uh -huh. Of course, you never talk anything about food. Uh -huh. You know, some people just don't get it. Oh, don't get me started on mm. taste. There are still faint glimmers of civilization left in this barbaric slaughterhouse that was once known as humanity. Oh. This is exactly that. A taste so unique, so special. I don't even get why some people would call this an acquired uh -huh. taste. Neophytes, assuredly. Oh. This is wonderful, Skipper. Thank you. Hmm. Uh -huh. Oh, Mickey. You're not here. What the hell are you? <laughs> I see two of you. That's the third one. Seriously, though, where is he? There he is. We need to talk. I've been... You know how I've been. Hey. Wanna go somewhere? Alright. Aren't you hungry? Yes, you are. 
Are you like that? Hey. Listen, let's just get on. I can't do this job without my brother. Let's just get on and talk it through. go with the kid just yet. I didn't plan this life for me and my brother. They used to call me the talker. I could talk your ear off. I would never shut up. However, right now, I don't want to talk. I should just be like my brother and take a moment. Pause and listen. Anything for a change. That chance. At my age, nothing is possible. Nobody changes. Anybody that tells you otherwise is lying or trying to sell you something. The only thing I would rather be is true to myself. That might make me an asshole in the end. That might make me a loyal brother to this man here. None of this shit matters. None of it. Do you know why we're here? It's because I have a small imagination. I can't see beyond my back streets, my town, my friends, my family. More importantly, I can't see a life beyond my brother. If he goes, I go. And the thing is, he went a long time ago. I just didn't want to admit it to myself. I was holding on to something from the past. My reputation, my house, my car, whatever it was. It was nice while it lasted. It just doesn't change anything. Anyway, you slice it, slice it. We're still marry as kids from South Broad. Nothing's ever gonna change. Not even in the end. Alright, Mickey. Deep breaths. Let's go see what everyone has been raving about. I'll send you a postcard, kid. Is that Astrid? Oh.
As foretold, here we go again, Spirit Fire. For the last time. Feeble and helpless, a faint murmur drifting in silence. Whisper words, a simple question. Why did you choose this life, Stella? Why did you spend it ushering others through their final moments? Was it your vocation and affectionate duty born of compassion? Or a display of selfishness, of everlasting uncertainty? Did you do it for them? Or for yourself? Know me and grow accustomed to my presence? To conquer me? Am I less daunting to you now? Or am I still a ghastly shadow, a deafening abs absence? Remember, when your body failed, you knew. You'd seen it a thousand times. You knew I would come. You fought valiantly, yet suffered all the same. I was deep within your heart, as I had always been. In your final moments, you accept my call. You slowly draw your last breath. And here we go again. And here we are. You know this is the end. But you're not alone. Embraced by the love of your mother. And now your sister. She is here holding your hand. Go now. You are not alone. I there's never a way to turn off these notifications, no matter what I do, they just stay. A hug? I found something you like, perhaps. Okay, thank you. Did you do it? <laughs> thank you. Oh, I can't let you go, kid, really. What do you want? I think you've been halting my progress. Huh. Must I do everything for you? You have not prepared lodging for me. Right this quickly. Something sparse, no froze, and I need it pro post haste. Go now. Huh. Hey, sure, I'm just. Yep, we are definitely having more flowers. Steel and pine. Pine plank and steel sheet. Still, 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 still. <laughs> Is it that because I sent Mickey away, do stuff and and keep and no one, no one wants to leave now? I'm. I have nothing against that. Really? I'm not amazed. The thing. Oh, one more. And I can make it. God damn it. Wow. 
one. Um, thank you. Maybe in the morning. Maybe I made the wrong one? <laughs> I have no idea. Um... What? Why is there another flower? Hey, I'll be there in a second. Ah, we're done. Thank you. What is going on? Flowers. in this part of town is a mess. And this place, it's a maze. Mm. Listen to me. I'm going on about the barking and look at you. Mm. Are you awake? Why are you holding on? Can you hear me sis? Mm. And say Lily is my favorite sister for me. Well, it's true. Mm. I'm your only sister, so you don't have the choice there. I wish I could hear your voice. I'd rather have you screaming, Lily, get out of my room! Mm. I'd rather have you laughing. Ever, even rather have you snoring. Mm. Let me come a bit closer. I'm asleep. It's late, I know. Mm. Yes, I'm two hours late. Sorry again. No wonder mom's passed it mm. out. Oh, I have a surprise for you. I swung by the house yesterday and got some things. Mm. Well, two things. First, where is it? Mm. There we are. Voila! A bottle of single malt from mom's secret stash. Mm. Don't worry, I'll do the drinking and the talking for both of us. And this, your photo album. Mm. It's got some good ones. Good baby pictures, fake family gatherings, mm. embarrassing college parties. The works. Let's start at the beginning. Mm. Stella, the adorable baby, is <laughs> being this cute should be a little. Give me a second, I'll put myself a drink. Mm. Oh, look at this one. You're so tiny. Where was it taken? Mm. What does it say on the back of the picture? Kalmar, Alsace, Alsace, 1973. Hello, Lily. Yes. We don't have any mysterious. Oh, the seed's not mysterious. It came from a mysterious seed. We need to build a house. Is it fine? Well. This will do. This will do nicely. But let me warn you. I need the per minimum. Please not add anything to these quarters. Not a single ornament. I just wanted to see how you're doing in there. Here and let's see what can I add after you. Wait. Yeah, it doesn't sound necessary for her. Captain! Ah! Uh, what does old Johnny Silver like see? I'm trying out a new actor, just for a bit. Your kin has boarded with a vessel. Our pirate captain has a sister. Or should I say, an able sailor. Someone to swap the decks, perhaps. No, no, no. Excuse me, your great pirate captain. We would give a member of your family such vile duties, especially since she has gifted us with such an extravagant gift. Uh. Yes. Ah, my mouth feels funny when I do this. Ah. Uh -huh. A great gift, indeed. 
The ability for the ship to travel during night time. How does it work? I do not care and I don't want to know. The only thing I know is, don't look a gift squid in the mouth. We are no longer bound by the laws of mere mortals. We are free to roam the open seas. Including when the sun goes down. We are pirates. We will live forever. Everyone knows that as pirate crimes are committed at night, we can now steal treasure instead of sleep. Hidden bounties to be discovered. No more Z's for this crew. Onwards, oh great pirate captain. Let's take the ship for its twilight maiden voyage. Okay. Sure. You weren't kidding. Actually, can I upgrade my ship? Okay. Now we need seven more golds, uh, two more electrums. Can we do that? Seven more gold. I don't think we have enough of that. Seven more gold. Yeah. And two electrum. I think we need gold to make courage. Oh, no, I think that's not true. We'll see Albert then. Another speed upgrade. And maybe the space upgrade. Let's see, what do we need for production? Two. Yeah, we need gold. And I said we need seven? If so, then we're fine. Okay, so let's set sail Albert's place. Ready? Ooh, sorry. They won't be happy I did that. <laughs> but it was a, an accident, really! And I think no one woke up. Okay, good. <laughs> it really was an accident, believe me. That's not it. Okay. Oh, like this. Think? I have no idea how this works whatsoever. I know how it's supposed to work, but... I'm not quite sure would I get it or not. And let's check it out. Eight gold and more pine planks. We can get those. Let's set up this. I need more. One more gold. That's better. Oh. It's not this much for now. Doesn't really matter that much. Yes, I know the eggs already. Thank you. But can we put eggs into the cellar? It should work. I'm gonna get this, <laughs> at least this thing done before I get off work. Oh, it might be a couple minutes longer than usual. Pine, pine. I think that should be enough! Or not, if I screw that up! Really? Yep. 
that's enough. And let's create that one electrum. Oh, that's gonna take a long time. A long time. Why won't you upgrade it so it does this automatically? Uh. I wonder, is the second player playing as the cat? And can the cat do everything Stella can? <laughs> and if so, how does this process look like with a cat? can sail even faster. I hope there's a mir mirror in the cellar of yours because it's looking gold. They <laughs> <laughs> gave me that upgrade. <laughs> Those upgrades. Okay, I guess that one was about his jokes. Diamonds, rose gold, shit, and XP potion. If only I knew how to make those, it'd be a lot easier. Thank you, Arful. And that's complete for today. So, let's set sail for. I'm not quite sure. Oh, let's set sail for Daria. Haven't seen her in a while. Ooh. I guess this is where the challenge happens. Okay, so, yeah, for now, thank you very much for your life, and see you soon. Bye!